Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. I am Akshay. Today I am going to explain you preparing strategy for TCS Code Vita. So TCS Code Vita Season 9 is going to start from July 2020. So you can also register for TCS Code Vita Season 9. I have already made a video how to register for TCS Code Vita. For this video, click on I button or I will leave a link in the description box. So move to the next important one. There are some things you should know about TCS Code Vita. As we all know, Code Vita is one of the TCS hiring contests for Ninja and Digital Profile across the nation. This is indeed a great opportunity for young minds to get hired in India's most admired brand TCS. TCS Code Vita Round 1 will be containing 6 coding problems that are framed in such a way that they test your analytical mind, implementation skills, and logical mind. So be ready with it. Now we discuss the difficulty level of coding problem. Here we have survey. Well, from the this survey we will conclude that two problems are of easy level, two problems are of medium level, two problems is hard or we can say that expert level. Here are some important topics to prepare. Dynamic programming, greedy algorithm, backtracking, stack, queue, tree, graph, mapping concepts, array manipulation, and string manipulation. Now, time to choose your weapon, that is programming languages. Choosing a proper weapon is an important part. In order to solve your coding problem, you will need a programming languages to implement your logic. You should always choose a language in which you are most comfortable with. However, we will suggest you the code either in C++, Java or Python. However, if you don't know any of these two languages, then don't panic. Just believe in your strength. Choose a platform to practice. After selecting a programming language, you need a platform in which you can practice a coding problem. We suggest you HackerRank, but why? See, there is a no hard and fast rule that you should use HackerRank only. You can use any other coding platform like HackerEarth, CodeShape, etc. for practicing a coding problem. HackerRank is a place where programmers from all over the world come together to solve the problems in a wide range of computer science domains such as algorithm, machine learning, and artificial intelligence, as well as to practice different programming paragraphs or language specific like python what should be my approach firstly analyze where you stand check out your current status and based on that analyze whether you will be able to crack the exam with your current skill set or you will need to prepare more for that best way is to check out the coding questions that were asked in tcs coder season 8 last year for practicing the TCS Code Vita questions, I am leaving the link in the description box. And if you don't have any experience with a competitive programmer or you are a beginner, then first try to solve problems that have easy difficulty level. And once you get familiar with it, try to increase your level with the decent pace and move on the medium or hard level. And if you are in a habit of solving such a coding problem, then all you need is to carry on your momentum. Participate in some of the mock coding contests to train yourself for final showdown. Expected cutoff. Here one of the important things. From the last year analysis, it was observed that people who completed even the single question were called for pre-placement interview at TCS. But this year, things have made more challenging and more competitive. In order to clear the TCS Code Vita 2020 round 1, you need to solve at least 2 or more coding problems out of 6. What is the pattern of interview? TCS interview process takes place at 3 steps. Technical interview, HR interview and manager round interview. All 3 interview rounds takes place in a single day. In a technical round, they basically question you from your resume, programming languages you know, and you are subject of interest, your project and most importantly they can even ask you about the coding problem that you solve in your code beta round 1. So prepare yourself accordingly. Main motive of HR interview is to check the thought process of interview 
as well as his or her confidence level. Key to nail any HR interview round is your confidence. For getting more updates on Codevita, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching this video.